when we find him in Justice League, he's definitely, we actually find him in Iceland and there's a, there's a you know tribe of people up there and they're kind of on the, the, the outskirts of, 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 the, of the world and he helps them and brings them fish and they kind of look up to him and they take care of him and he doesn't want to be around a lot of people. He's very much the outsider and the, the lone wolf. When you put everything on, whether it's holding the trident, put the eyes in, you put the costume on, it being heavy or not, it's just you're right into the character. And that's a beautiful thing. That's when you're working with really talented artists. From props to obviously Michael, who has made all of our costumes and they're amazing. You actually kind of geek out because when you get to see everyone, they look unbelievable. Like it's truly like a little fan, I don't know, fanboy moment, or just you feel like a little kid and you're like, that's that man. And you just get a look at Batman and you kind of poke him and like, he's like staring at him like, it's cool. From Ezra and, and, and Ben, obviously he has his own thing, Henry, Gal, we're all put on set and when we're together, it's like a big family and it's, there's not any problems. We didn't have one problem, no egos, no, no drama and when you're in your costumes and it's hot or it's cold or it's, you know, you're just in hell together. So there's these great comedic moments. It's super action adventure. We're all over the place. A lot of sets that are like, we're in tons of big, beautiful sets. And then it's a whole world that you've just never seen before.